tell me who your top five inspirations are. Forrest Whitaker. Okay. Angela Bassett. Okay. Yeah, I can see her playing my mom in the movie. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of actors out here that would love that, you know, because if Angela Bassett's in it, you know that half of Black America at least is seeing whatever that is. Yeah. Denzel, of course. Okay. Johnny Depp. Johnny Depp? Yeah. Got one more. Samuel L. Jackson. So, obviously, with everything going on right now, we got to touch on some current events. Now, we got to talk about Me Too, right? It's real big in Hollywood right now. Me personally, I'm gonna tell you my opinion, none of it is based on anything because I don't know any of these people. Now, my thoughts are all of these things with this Me Too movement, with Bill Cosby and his situation, I think this has always been going on. I think that it is going on right now. And I think that I don't know what the reason is, but there's clearly been some type of shift in the energy, wherein the bad guys who have been running things maybe are losing some ground to the bad guys who they were fighting against, because I, I assume they're all bad and terrible. Now, with this whole Me Too situation, um, where are you with it all, and how do you feel about it? Can you break that down for us? Okay, so the Me Too situation, uh, for those of you who don't know, I'm pretty sure you do, you're just asking for a more specific question. The Me Too situation, there's a long list of Hollywood actresses that are coming out saying um, Harvey Weinstein forced them into sexual activity in order for them to further their career. A long list of um, Hollywood executives and um, high-level people like uh, Louis C.K. and um, what's the Kevin Spacey. Oh, yeah. The Kevin Spacey one bothered me a lot because when he addressed it after he got called out, when he addressed it, his response was, "Oh, hey guys, I'm sorry, I'm gay. I've been struggling with my homosexuality for a long time." And to me, that was absolute bullshit because you being gay has absolutely nothing to do with you raping a 15 year old boy. Oh yeah. Um, but the Me Too situation as a whole, do you think that one, it's good that it's coming out and two, do you think that some women who may have been compliant at the time, now that their career isn't where they want it to be, do you think they're trying to manipulate the current energy? Is it good that it came out? Yes, of course. Uh, but it should have came out a long time ago. For Why sure. Did Why didn't it? They, they kept sweeping it under the rug. Why now then? Because I, I agree with you and that's the same thought process I follow. Why now? And it's not like you have the answers. I just want you to speculate yeah, with me. I feel like it's a publicity stunt, you know? To distract people's minds from what's really going on with the, the black nation and everything that we're dealing with and everything in the world that, you know, we're dealing with collectively as a unit. Some of these women are true victims, but like you said, I think that it's a misdirect. The fact that the media now is pretending to give a fuck about these victims who have been trying to get their stories heard. 